Okay, my vote for movie night is that one Hallmark movie where the Prince Charming buys the girl a horse, like to prove his love. What was that called? I don't remember, but it was seriously the most romantic movie I think I've ever seen in my entire life. I wish that was my life. No, not like acting. I mean, like, I wish that was like my real life. I guess it kind of could be. I mean, you're my Prince Charming and well, Christmas is right around the corner. So it could be. What? Oh, sorry. I was just lost in a daydream. Just like waking up on Christmas morning and looking outside my window and there's a horse on my lawn. No, not like Kazi got out of the pen. I mean like my dream horse and it has a bow on the top of its head and it just starts snowing at the exact right moment. And the whole thing was a surprise. But alas, it's just a daydream. Unless for some reason it happened, which would be great. So yesterday I was at the bar with Sarah and we're talking about our dream horses, right? Cause like, you know, and she says, oh my gosh, Marina, I literally know someone who is selling your exact dream horse right now. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's Christmas time, which is like, it's just kind of crazy. Cause it's like the perfect timing with like being Christmas and all of that. Then I was just thinking of like, what if somebody surprised me and bought me my dream horse? You know, and like, I didn't know it. I mean, what's like the likelihood of that happening? Like my dream horse being for sale, Sarah knowing who it is and like, you knowing Sarah and I put her number in your phone and then it like showing up here on Christmas morning. Slim chances, right? But anyways, I just thought it was like so funny. Babe, I finally updated all of my equestrian contacts. I have the vet, the farrier, and some confirmation specialists. I trust these people with all my horse-related decision-making. So if I'm not around and you have a question, just call them. Why wouldn't I just ask you? I mean, maybe you wanna surprise me with something sometime and they would be a good resource. You mean like, surprise, I got your horse's feet trimmed or I took Kazi to the vet to get her coggins pulled? Surprise? Mm, more like, Oh my gosh, this Pinto is my wife's exact dream horse in color, size, attitude. I just wish I knew something about confirmation or even if I had a booklet of people to consult. Oh, what's this? Okay, okay, I think you've dropped enough hints. Me? Dropping hints? No, that doesn't sound like me. I know that we're all hoping to look out our window on Christmas morning and see our dream horse wrapped in a bow, but let's be honest, we need some backup ideas. So I have you covered. GypsyEquestrian.com has been updated with a bunch of new designs for every horse lover in your life, including you. Maybe you're a fan of Kazi, Zara, and Zinni, and you've just been wondering, what would they look like as cute little reindeers? Well. I got you covered. Or maybe you're one of the people who've been asking me to make a coffee hoodie, but with Mustangs included in it. Then I got you covered. Or maybe you're like a really talented dressage rider and you want everybody to know it. I got you covered. Whatever your equestrian fancy is, you can find it at gypsyequestrian.com. As always, thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel. I'll see you all in the next one. Psst, I accidentally ordered this in the wrong size. It's a small. And this is a large, I like them oversized. So I'm not gonna wear it because I don't wanna get anything on it because I'm gonna give it to somebody for Christmas, so. But super cute and it's true, right? Am I right? Can you find Zara, Kazi, and Zinni?